Sorry for the technical difficulties there. So what's going on YouTube is Tree War. So I'm looking for gravestones. I think I got them all from uh, floor one through four. I got Kenchi as a card. I'm pretty disappointed on what they're giving us. Other people are going to be fucking stoked. You get Raiden's uh, Brutality Stick, which is, I mean, if I didn't have that, I'd be so happy. Uh, I have, well, that video will be out by the time this is out. So it's crazy that I got a rare, uh, I got a rare crypt, uh, I think it was Quan Chi, a rare, yeah, a rare crypt, uh, equipment piece, brutality, in Faction War, I thought that was insane, if you didn't watch the last video, well then yeah, I guess maybe you should. Well, I don't I don't say it in the titles. I kind of just, you know, say, you know, hey, uh, like, I think I'm titling that. I haven't put it out yet, but I think I'm going to title it Newest Crypt Event with Faction Rewards. So people are going to be like, oh, Faction Reward, whatever, but... It's actually kind of cool. This is actually a tough fight. It's been it's been a little rugged. A little little rugged. I will say so myself. Yeah, take him out, please. Get him out of there. I need him gone. Take this dude out too quick. Leaving these death marks uh, should be helping. Well, it's not like I'm fighting in faction war or some shit like that. So it's like. Are they needed? Do they matter? That's going to help a lot. I don't think I'm going to get anything because I got that. I mean, you. I have gotten two. I've gotten a card. I've gotten a rare. I believe I've gotten a card in Epic. I think I've gotten a rare and an Epic. So, I mean, it's possible. We'll see. Nope. One. Dude, and this is weird. I got 982. Usually I get 1,027. I get something, but I did open up a lot of things I got three large no three small three large yeah so that's and one uh, uh why do I always have trouble with this word I've said it multiple times it invigorating inv in invigorating yeah so yeah my week has been kind of uh, shitty I guess. Uh, someone that I really cared about passed away, which sucks. Well, we, uh, is there a, no, there isn't. <laughs> yeah, it really sucks when, uh, when that shit happens. I mean, you know, when it's like someone really old, or, you know, you, you expect it, you know, but, I don't, I don't know, it just sucks. This person wasn't old, they were young. Like that, I mean, should that really be a difference? I mean, still, it all sucks either way you look at it. There's one Luke Kang. So, I mean, I could drop a Luke in there. That kind of bungles everything I want to do, though, right? And if I put her in there... I guess I could switch it up, right? I always do this. And I feel like this is a good setup for... Uh, for uh, crypt. 
I wouldn't do that, I don't think, for, like, s Survivor or Faction. And then I guess I can have him as backup. What would you do? Well, I want him to have, uh, so maybe like this, and then Weather Warfare. I passed it. Yeah, sorry, my brain's not really. The strange so far in my life, uh, two ex-girlfriends have uh, passed away. But this one, I've known for... a long time. Like, I, there was a picture she sent me. I remember when she got placed in, like... Uh, she got put in placement. You know, when you act up in high school, they send you there. And that was in 2000, because it was dated. I just read it. And... She was very modest in the, uh, in the, uh, message that she wrote on the back. It was like, I, I don't think I, I, I knew it, I, I didn't realize it before, you know, what she, you know, what she was saying, but it was like, oh, you know, she's just, I don't look good in this picture, and then she's, she wrote, I, and then there's a letter, like, scribbled out, and then she wrote, I figured I'd give you one, and I'm looking closer at it now, and the letter was W, so I figured I wanted to give you one, but she was trying to play it cool, like, you know, you know I'm just handing this out to everybody, and she did give them, like, that's, I think the most popular picture that's out of her right now. But, uh... At that time, we were dating. Well, kind of dating. Oh, that's going to suck, because hey, I, I set that up wrong. It's supposed to be this. <laughs> but. Yeah, back then, it, it, to this day, the song uh, by Incubus, I Miss You. Always made me think about her. Because 2000, Make Yourself was a huge album. But it's, uh. <sighs> Another thing that gets me, I, again, I don't care if anyone believes me. So I had this dream, right? It was fucked up. So, like, it, now... So, my friend, when he sent... Uh, everyone now is finding out about Brandy. Right? Now, three days ago... My friend told me about it, but I told him five, five days ago before he sent me anything. I said, listen, I need you to check on Brandy and I need to check on, I need you to check on your sister. Cause I had this dream where me, Brandy and my friend's sister are in my mama's house, which she's, she's been dead for a very long time. And Brandy needed to use a bathroom. There's only one bathroom in the place. Like, 
in real life, but I was upset that she wanted to use that bathroom for some reason. I said, go use the, go use the other bathroom. And she said, okay. And I was like, well, we're going to the store. So we go to the store, and I rented three DVDs. I don't remember what the DVDs were. And then we start walking up this wooden staircase that literally just led to nowhere. And we just keep walking up it. Eventually, we get back to my grandmother's house from MMA. And uh, Brandy's cleaning, like vacuuming. And I'm like, well, you don't need to do that. Like, why are you doing that? And she was like, oh, well, you know, I don't mind. And then I went in the other room and my MMA was on the floor gasping for air. And I'm panicking and I lift her up and I put her on the couch. This is my dream that I had now, in my view. And I'm shaking her and I'm crying and I'm just saying, you know, wake up, like, breathe, just breathe. And I woke up. And that's when, hey, this is not my first, I know it sounds fucked up and, I don't, again, I don't care if anyone believes me. I, why, I, why the fuck would I want to make something up like this? Nobody wants this shit to happen. Nobody wants to, this sucks. This sucks. So, I wake up, I hit up my boy, and I'm like, yo, you need to talk to your sister. And if you do me a favor, go on Facebook. And, because I don't, I don't do Facebook anymore because I feel like it's really, like, fake. And I, I just can't stand it. I really can't. I, I fucking hate it. I don't even have a Facebook for my YouTube uh, account. Like, I have it, but I just don't go on it because I fucking hate it. So, uh, like, two days after that, he's like, bro, uh, yeah, Brandy passed. And I was like, oh, okay. So, not the first time I've dreamt something and it happened. It's usually always something bad. It's never anything good. It's not like, yo, you're going to win the lottery. You're going to become rich. It's always something fucking negative. I wonder why that is. And how is it even possible? That, that's another take from it. It's like, how is this fucking possible? It shouldn't be... I, Maybe it's possible because we're all one. Maybe I'm right. If we're all one, the only thing that keeps us separate is our individualities, our bodies. Then when you leave it, you'd be able to talk to other bodies. It would be harder to talk to someone in their waking day, but it might be easier to talk to them when they're asleep, right? Like, because they're in between realities. They're in between dimensions, maybe. I don't, I don't fucking know. I just find it weird to dream things and it fucking happens. <sighs> it's, that shit drives me nuts. It really does. It... Tell you, it makes you not want to sleep much. Which, I mean, I really barely sleep anyways, but... I wonder if I can uh, just block and get a death mark on him. Thank you. Man, I got fuck. I got woken up today. That was fun. Not really. I mean, definitely being sarcastic there. Fucking doorbell, ding, 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 ding. It's like a fucking someone won a jackpot on a slot machine. Like once is enough. Ring the doorbell once. You know, someone will hear it. 
I'm just doing a wellness check. Like, a wellness check for what? Like, really? Somehow, I, it's hard for me to believe that's why you're here. You want something. So, yeah, life's been, uh, I don't know, it's been... What really sucks is I, I just wish she didn't like live all the way in Florida and shit and because if she was closer I'd be able to see her I would have been able to see her a lot more than not at all I remember before she left she was at my house she wasn't doing good then either, though, really, so. Then I, then I try to think of it like in a positive note, right? She ain't in pain, she's not suffering. I re remember when her dad died, that really fucked her up, which, losing a parent would fuck anybody up, I feel like, whatever age you may be. That really, uh, did a toll on her, so, it, in the way I'm think I'm trying to think about it, is at least she's with her father now. That's a good thing, right? Stay away from fucking needles. Like, even, like, yeah, that, that is the best advice I could give anyone. Even, like, let's say you are on fentanyl, because most of the fucking world is now. If you're on heroin or fentanyl, stay the fuck away from needles. Not only are they bad to the point where, you know, you can give yourself hepatitis C, by the way, right? So not only that, but it's it's just bad in so many fucking ways. And dope, that's just... And there was a video I saw, ABC News released it, I don't know if it's real or not, maybe... Maybe the cop was a junkie themselves, but they said that they touched, they were wearing gloves. This is the thing, because I was, I mean, I was, a, I was a drug addict. I know about this shit. I know it's strong, but she said she was wearing gloves and she overdosed. I'm like, what? Then again, I had a very high tolerance back then. That's why, like, I would know relapse is out of the fucking question. No fucking way. I mean, that would really suck. Probably the least painful way to die, I would think, right? Fall asleep and that's it. You can think of worse. Especially my brain. I'm a fucking cra I'm crazy, man. I can definitely think of much worse ways to die. I don't know if that's what happened. I don't know much. I'm, again, I don't go on Facebook. I'm not talking to anybody, really.
Whoa, that's the wrong one. I remember, if you look at my videos, I might have mentioned this, but I had a dream about when my dogs were alive. Mojo, I was holding him when he was dying in my dream. And I told my dad about it. And he was like, well, where was Honey? I was like, she wasn't there. And he goes, okay, well, then we know which dog goes first. And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Like, what? And sure as shit, he was right. Just... Honey died first. Yeah, I didn't get that from that. I just made sure that that dream didn't come reality. So when he did pass, he wasn't in the same spot. Made damn sure. Same area. Just not in the exact same spot. But, yeah, held them both. That sucked too. It's weird when someone dies, it... Just... You think of death in general. All the things that have been lost. But, I mean, those dogs lived a very long, long life, and a great life. And I feel like hers was a lot of pain. So I'm thinking, right, if they're going to put other brutality equipment in this to get Shang Tsung's friendship now, it's probably going to be damn near fucking impossible. Unless, hopefully, the only ones that pop up for epics is Quan Chi's brutality and also Shang Tsung's friendship because they are considered crypt equipment. Wait, hold on, did, did I get every fucking tombstone? That, is anything open? No. Yup. Good. <laughs> this video more likely is just going to be a standalone. Yeah, I feel like when my dogs passed, YouTube was a good way for me to keep busy. Somewhat stay positive, you know, just keep making videos, just stay busy. That's, yeah, that sucks. This sucks. So I got two five nine. Now that sounds about right. And I did every match in the last one. I don't understand why it was so low. Right now, I mean Oh, I know why it was a lot higher. Never mind. I had three uh Johnny Cages. I'm only using two. I could use three, but...
Damn. I shouldn't take too much health off because of, uh... The shield or defense, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I should use him more. He's, he is really good. Also, I probably shouldn't record every step. You know what would be dope? Is if there was like a... A fire... Uh, chest. That costs... I don't know. Souls, maybe? 500 souls, and it would be an epic card. Guaranteed epic. Hey, go ahead, do your kick. Yep. Yeah, I knew you were gonna do it. That's alright. Fuck you. Yeah, you don't like that, did you? Stop it. Don't touch me. Take that. Better get your hits in. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the next update they should add in like a crypt like that. Or it co would cost hearts. I would like it to cost hearts and souls. So many things cost souls, so many things cost coins. I also, since I got uh, the rare in Faction War, I spent a shit ton of coin in the equipment store to see if maybe I could get uh, some... Crypt uh, Epic or Rare equipment. Unfortunately, not. I wonder if... Uh, oh, no, never mind. I can't wonder now. Or maybe it... No. I wonder if his, like... This guy right here... If I knock someone out with him, would they come in and be frozen? Because of weather warfare? I don't... I've, I'm not sure. I hope I didn't check if that was Guardian or not. I just saw Terminator. Hopefully it is. Yeah, it is. Should give me a chance to try out my theory. So now that's him. Oh, it does work. Wait a second, I'm me. Why is it? What the fuck just happened? Well, now I don't know if it works. Did him just coming into the match kill my little dude? That's fucked up. I also gotta use uh, Lizard Noob. I really hope they make a Lizard Scorpion. And, again, Pyromancer team, like, there's so much for them to do. I hope they don't make Mortal Kombat 1 cards. Like, fuck that. This is its own game. Let it be its own game. Don't. No. Just be you.
me, what? Huh? You tricked me, you dick. No. Stop it. Alright, no. No, so it doesn't work. Interesting. Oh, I keep... It keeps tricking me. He's dead. I'm trying to... I think he has... Geek defense on him. I'm trying to get some health for my team, but it's not working. That's all what I unlocked, really. Another thing I don't understand is why the fuck was I getting one? Like, usually you get three, five, or six. I don't think I've gotten anything higher than six hearts in one match. Fucking one? Really? That's like the ultimate, like, yeah, fuck you. I got hurt feelings. I got hurt feelings. The day after my birthday is not my birthday, mom. Flight of the Concords, anybody? No. HBO. Kind of like Tenacious D, but New Zealanders. Anybody? Check them out. It's fucking hilarious, I'm telling you. TV show, Flight of the Concords. Some hilarious shit you're missing out on. Yeah, I don't think I can sound like I'm from New Zealand or Australian. Kano, isn't he from Australia? I just find that hilarious. Especially, like, what, what does he say? It's my birthday. 2000 something. I forget what it was, the date. But they forgot about me. Kind of like they forgot about Dre, but they used the other line. And then his friend just starts singing the I got hurt feelings part. And he's like, the day after my birthday is not my birthday, mom. Come on, you have to have that relative or someone. The day that's after your birthday, say, hey, happy birthday. You're like, yeah, it's not my birthday anymore. Everyone has that one person in their life where it's like, yeah, it's, uh, thanks, but uh, yeah, it's okay. It's all good. Because I feel like at a, after a certain time, right, when, you're, when you become the age of drinking, maybe birthdays matter two years after that, so we'll see. Two. Damn, he's just hitting me right up. And then after that, I feel like they don't matter for a long time. Up until 30s. And then a little bit later in life, they matter again because you don't know when the fuck your last one's going to happen. It could happen any day. Well, not any day, but you could die any day, so... Every holiday, every fucking occasion matters because it could be the last one. You never know. Usually I feel like that should probably only hit you when you're like 50 or higher. But for me, it kind of hit two years ago. Holidays started mattering again. Birthdays mattering because it's like I don't know how many more of these I'm going to have. So might as well make the most of it. See, in my 20s, I was like, yeah, I don't give a fuck. Who cares? It's another day. So you go from caring to not caring to caring. Some people are fortunate enough to care forever. Especially, like, 
Christmas, I was more like depressed. Thanksgiving, family holidays, I was depressed. I think that was because my mom bounced. And it wasn't like my grandma or my meme grandma. I, I say grandma because people have no idea what the fuck a meme is, so it's easier to say. But I always called her meme. That's French for grandma. A Canadian French. I don't. I don't know if it's actual like from France French. I guess they're they're spoken different. There's got to be another match. Oh, there's two. I feel like I'm going to get something from this, and it's going to be something I do not want. Like a dumb card. Like a Kano, for instance. Or, uh... Kenshi was the last one. That pissed me off. Shouldn't he have been frozen? Like that. Hey! No, don't touch me. <laughs> but yeah, I really hope they don't start making Mortal Kombat 1 cards. Because we have classic cards. Like I said, this game is its own now. Like, so, make whatever the fuck you want. Ooh, that's nice. I like that. Oh, that's very nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Maybe I can pull an epic out. I just doubt it will be the one I want. Watch it be like... Quan Chi or the goddamn fucking spear. It sh that should not pop up in here. To sell it? Okay. Yeah, that's dope. To pop up in quest or quest in the crypt that no. Negatory. Negatorious. Okay, I think that's it. That about does it. Let's look around. Am I forgetting anything? No. Time to start opening things. <laughs> I think this gives me a hundred right here. That's going to be dope. Yeah. I'm not going to open any of these, but I think it might be smart to close that little gap. So. Is there anything down? Because I can just skip all this part. Nope. I'll just go back up. Go over. Yeah, Tenacious D actually talked shit about Flight of the Concords somewhat recently. I'm hoping uh, they come back with a diss track. <laughs> that, yeah, that show is fucking hilarious. I should own that. I, if I don't own that, no, I don't own that show. Not on DVD. That's no good. I wonder if it was even released. There's so many shows that just need to be released that isn't. Like I got Dark Darkwing Duck, right? It's not even the full series. I thought it was. Volume, I think it's like 1, 2, and 3. I thought that was the whole series. Nope. One of the seasons has like 36 episodes. All of them combined don't even have all that. So that gave me hurt feelings. Yeah, this episode on my channel is about death and hurt feelings. <laughs> Not really, but... <sighs> A 
They start. Uh, they don't make volumes of things. That that pisses me off. Family Guy Volume Two, and it's like not even a fucking. Just make seasons, or when the show ends, just complete series that shit with specials and everything like that. Fuck yeah. You know, did she miss me somehow? Good. What you get? Why don't you freeze? You're gonna get hurt. Yeah, he don't do nothing. Other than fuck you up. <laughs> Shabam. Let's see if I can pull an epic here. Or if it gives me nothing. Five, okay. Alright, alright, alright. This is where I get scared. And I, I feel like I'm gonna pull a fucking, just a card. <laughs> oh boy. I was pissed when I saw... Like, if they want to add to, you know... It should be Shang Tsung's equipment and then Raiden's uh Raiden's brutal brutality equipment. You know what I'm saying? Nah I'm saying, nah I mean That jack that jack is tight, son, nah I mean Scary movie? No? Anybody? Jesus, making all these references, nobody knows. Feel all alone. I wonder if, if if I if he does a brutality to me, or if someone does a brutality like this, well, is it, is that the end for old newbie? I wanted. I wanted to see if I do my second special attack. Will that freeze him? No, I have it set up differently. He doesn't, duh. I'll be alright. It's not really thinking clearly, I guess. That was a spiky, right? What I plan on doing, I think, is not doing two in a row. Pick one, do one. Pick, you know, switch it up. When you think you know me right, I switch it up. Behind the wall. Hop a finch a cab, ain't no one gonna stop us. No, oh, this is the ep episode. Wow. I think I'm going fucking crazy. This is the match where I should be pulling out this shit. Be doing, uh, leaving some marks. Death marks all around for everybody. That looks kind of sick. Hey. Hey. Fuck off. Hey. Well, you're the last one, so I guess that's okay. Wow. Did someone die on the other side? Did anyone else see someone fly back on my side? Like, what the hell was that? I'll never slow-mo to watch it, but someone should check that out. That was weird. So, wait, that was a uh, normie, right? So, that was a norm. This is a spike. Norm spike, norm spike, norm spike, norm spike. If I go spike, spike, norm, norm, hey, maybe there's a chance to get something. Or maybe this is the way how you get shit. I don't know. I haven't figured out this, uh... I haven't figured it out. It's too new. Oh, what am I thinking? It's fucking this guy. This fucking guy over here. And his other fucking friend. This fucking friend guy. Yeah. No, wow, really? You didn't give... What? 
He didn't have his back, bro. You're a bitch, Leatherface. All right, go back home and put on your makeup. What the fuck was that? Am I seeing shit? Like, did I, th I swear I thought I saw something come out from, like, the back for a second. It looked like it was on fire or something. I don't know. I'm also really tired. When am I not tired? Like, what? That's, uh, like, I'm tired, but I don't sleep. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that was an, uh, whoa, a three-way? Don't see many of them. Was that a spike or non-spike? Fuck. Roll the dice. <laughs> Another erection. It said two. Right, duh. If it says two, then if you use two, it's gonna fully give him health. That said two, didn't it? Now this would make me use three. What the? F Am I going fucking nuts? Please comment below. If I, I mean, I'll be okay with it, you know. I mean, I expect it one day. It's not this soon, but if I'm going crazy, please let me know. But I swear, I saw like someone die in the background on my side, which nobody's dying at all. And I saw someone on fire on my side. Then that one didn't make any sense at all. Why did I just miss there? I should have got that with a kick. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, wait, these are uh, erection guys. They get erect. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I know. It does look really cool. I wish he was... Oh, that would look even like... I, mean, I thought. Oh, maybe I left the death mark on him? I don't know. Fuck it. Another three way. Another three way. Jesus. Hmm. <laughs> No, I just did a normie, right? Oh, I can't remember. <coughs> oh, I don't like this. Don't like this at all. Hmm, what do I do? I know what I do. No, that ain't gonna really work, is it? Oh, I got away with that. Who sh no shit. Go me. Screw your bat. Oh, if you're classic movie Johnny Cage, that bat does nothing. If you just use your, uh, that power thing, 
the fourth, I don't know, special, I don't know what you want to call it, special attack or whatever, all right, okay, so this is where I'm kind of nervous, so there is three, le four left, I'm not doing this one, I'm leaving that one empty, but this could lead to something good. And the other one could lead to something good. So. Meh. Meh. You know? It's meh. I don't know what to do. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. I wonder if it, what happens if I scream your head off. I don't know. I don't think I've ever screamed the uh, endoskeleton's head off, or smashed up the body. And now we'll never know. But you know, in this game, right? She screams the head off, but in MK11, she doesn't. So, what if she does? What if that was, like, a secret for them telling... Because, like, I found... If you watch my live streams... Then you know that I know a Fujin brutality that makes the screen 3D. If you haven't watched it, there's an 8-minute video that shows, shows it. I show you how to do it. So if you're a Fujin player or you like Fujin, go check it out. It's under my live streams. It's like an eight minute video. The shortest one there is there. <laughs> go check that out. And uh in in this game Sindel blows the head off, right? But in MK eleven MK eleven it just shoots a hole into the head what if there's a way and they're showing us in this game to be like oh there's a variation where the head blows off completely because there's a sub-zero when you forward uh i think when you do a forward uh grab the body spikes up in the ceiling and that's a brutality well if you hold down i think the body drops not that big of a difference uh with scorpion the get over here uh, if you hold back, it rips off the head instead of the heart. And apparently there's something to do with that slide from Sub-Zero. So, that's a lot of little differences, you know what I mean? Nah, I mean... <laughs> so I'm wondering if uh, there's another one. Jesus. I'm most definitely going to get some garbage card. I'm going to be so pissed. I'm definitely not doing the one near... Oh, fucking A. Well, I forget what Fujin Brutality is in this game. It should be the Breathless. That would be dope. But it isn't. What the fuck is his... What is his Brutality in this game? Why do I forget? It is Breathless. Isn't it? Yeah, it is. He blows off the skin, right? Or am I fucking going not? I gotta... Wow, dude, I forgot... Now is time for me, like, because since there's so many fucking brutalities, it's time for me to make that video that I've been saying I was going to make fucking, like, a year ago. 
and I'm leaving behind because I'm scared to get something. This, because I have one more floor to go. And this, I'm, I'm not doing it. I'm collecting all my fucking gravestones and I'm bouncing. <laughs> Maybe, oh, but what if that gives you a fucking rare? That would suck. Anyways, I'm going to pause this and collect. I had to do that battle near the end because it could be a tombstone. And if I forget that, that might throw everything off. And my device is about to die. So that's not good because it's going to stop recording after a certain point, like any second now. So I have to find the charger. Where are you? Hello. Thank you. Don't hit me. That's cheap shot, motherfucker. I was a after like four percent, it dies. I was at seven. That's crazy. And it dies quick. I notice every update you do on a device that's older, they seem to. Uh... Yeah, did you see that thing? Like noob, like bounces back. Like I just saw that. That I just. That's real. Like I ain't crazy. I mean, I am, but I'm not. Sweet. I didn't get anything. Good, 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 good. That gave me three points. I'm fucking happy. Makes me kind of want to do the other one, but... We're going for the, for the big guns this time. We ain't trying to get no rare. We're trying to get an epic here. Leaving one behind, I don't think we'll hurt on that, because we got another whole floor... So yeah, I'm pausing. You know, I was just thinking about the assholes, and yes, they are assholes on here, that fake, like, their girlfriend's death and to do a 3 a.m. fucking video, like, I kind of want to punch them in the face. And I think I gotta be more mature than that, because that's, like, you know, pathetic. Like, well, okay, well, you're gonna hit him in the face for what? Them trying to get views? Them preying on kids? Pretty much what they are, because any a, adult... I mean, I'm gullible, but I wouldn't fall for their shit. <laughs> and I am. I am pretty gullible. Like, but whatever. Oh shit, he does it too normally? Damn. Then who doesn't do that move? Do they all do it? <laughs> no. Classic just does it repeatedly. It would be cool if you go if you could get like three. If you, because it's hard to get, not as hard as uh, classic Sub Zero second special. That one is fast and hard, like past two, I think. <laughs> All right, so there's that. There's two spikes. That sucks. So I feel like in uh, for not getting anything, spike, not spike, spike, not spike. It seems like going back and forth seems to be doing something. I mean, I, 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 I don't. <laughs> like I said, I, I believe in my feats of strength theory way more than anything that I can come up with yet. But I did pick, I and I don't know if I released that video yet, but there's one where I was like, I know I'm going to get an epic right now. And bam, I got it. I don't know how the fuck I did that. I should rewatch that. Why didn't you... Why didn't the demon bird do anything? That was a special attack. Maybe because I came out as a different person? So, tech... Huh. Intro to... Now he attacks? What the shit was that? 
And where'd all my bars go? You better slam him in the air and brutality him. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> you dirty bitch, you. You killed my father. Prepare to die. Or is it, you kill my mother? Yeah, you the or. Another three way. There goes a three way. <laughs> so yeah, stay away from needles. That's uh, a big thing. So you, you can like get abscess, you can lose an arm. Uh, a needle, literally, I know someone that got a needle stuck in their, in their vein and it cannot be removed. Because it's in a very dangerous spot. It's in their neck. Obviously I'm not naming names. Because I'm not a fucking douchebag. But that is possible. I know it's possible. Because I've seen that sh Well I didn't see it. But I know it's possible. So it can break off. And it, that's exactly what happened. Uh, you can give yourself hepatitis C. With a dirty needle. So even if you don't share needles, if it's old and, uh, what do you call it, like, <laughs> oh, you little bitch. Uh, yeah, if it's old and, like, dirty. You can, yeah, you can give yourself hepatitis C. <laughs> Obviously, uh, the most important, overdosing and dying. Someone on this earth gives a fuck about you. Someone wants better for you. And I know quitting opiates ain't the fucking easiest thing. Trust me, I know. But... Switch to sniffing and then try to get yourself in a program. Go on Subutex, Suboxone, Methadone, you know. Not easy, man. I know. It's not, but... Usually I say, you know, do it for yourself. Not just for yourself, but... You know, you're not alone in this fucking world. Now, personally, me, I never got into the needle world, luckily. But, I did get shot up when I got in my car accident. They shot me up, and that feeling, I, I know the feeling. Holy shit. But, is it worth your life? Seriously. And again, I understand the feeling of no one caring about you and you feeling like you're fucking alone and nothing's worth anything and everything sucks. The way to fix that is when you start thinking negative, you got to think positive. So it's like retraining your brain, like, like reworking that shit out. You know what I'm saying? Like, for instance, since I can remember, like, in the fourth grade, I used to tell myself, I'm ugly, I'm worthless, I'm stupid, I'm a scumbag, everyone has someone except me. I've said that shit since the fourth grade up into 20-something years old. Crazy, right? Most people, if they said that to themselves daily, they would probably kill themselves and like I said I you know I tried but like I didn't do the ultimate fucking ch you know I didn't do a Kurt Cobain which I honestly don't think he killed himself but that's another topic but uh you gotta like retrain yourself to think differently so Anytime you have those negative thoughts, you got to say stop. And then you got to think of something positive about yourself. Or just, if it's really bad, just positive in general. <laughs> so, 
it took me five years for that to like work. And after that five years, I like it worked. I didn't want alcohol, thank God. Because after fentanyl and heroin, I was a brutal alcoholic. Couldn't sleep. Like you, if someone doesn't know about this addiction, let me tell you a little bit. So coming off of it, right? You know, people say, "Well, quitting is easy. You just stop doing what you're doing. It's it's that easy." No, it's not. So you go through a thing that I call hell. <laughs> uh, your leg shakes like you, not not the vibrating thing when you stick it up in the like you, you're on your heel. You'll be laying flat on your bed, and your foot will start shaking like rapidly to the point where you can't control this. You want to lop off your fucking foot. It, it's that frustrating and that angry. I start slamming my foot on the fucking bed because I can't stand it. No sleep. No sleep at all. I mean, I took sleeping pills to knock me out that would knock out someone for days and knocked me out for an hour, maybe two hours. So, and then you have a thing called cold sweats, which I think that's a God's cruel joke. So you're sweating. And, but you're cold and you have goosebumps because you're so cold. Your body should not be able to be cold and sweating at the same time. That should be illegal. It should, it should, it's against laws of nature. It's fucked up. It ain't right. So with the restless leg syndrome plus the, the uh, withdrawals... No sleeping through any of this. Other people have other symptoms that could be a lot worse. The, those are mainly... The worst ones for me is the cold sweats. The zero sleep. And this lasts... It used to, it used to last for like three days and it was very bad. Now, from what I heard of, it can last over a week possibly two because they did something to the synthetic heroin or synthetic fentanyl to make it last like methadone how evil can you fucking be to not only get people addicted to this but to make the withdrawals worse that they stay on it how much how fucked up of a human like money's worth that much to you like I don't get it and these are people in like labs like smart motherfuckers obviously you have to be smart to make synthetic heroin I would think it's not like it's uh, bathtub meth this is some real fucking shit we're talking about you know so I like I don't get it But anyway, so after the withdrawals are done, uh, so you go through hell, right? That's what I, I call that period hell. Uh, my hell would be uh, withdrawals and also very bad things happening to love people in front of me. The people that I love, bad things continually happening, That would uh, that would be hell going through withdrawals for the rest of my being and bad things happening to the people I care about. Yeah, that, that, that would be hell. So after hell is done, you go through eight months for me of shittiness, which that means is, uh, Sleep? Huh. What's sleep? What is, what is sleep? There's no such thing as sleep. The 
the sleep I get for eight months. My dreams are my dream. I've I'm a very vivid dreamer. Very like I remember all my dreams. Like sometimes I get lucky, and sometimes I don't remember them. <laughs> but other times, like when when I when I was getting clean, eight months, it was like I was living a different world. Like I like I lived here. I would go to sleep and I would live that world. It was that bad. So that means I wake up from that world and live in this world. So that means there is no sleep. That means I, I, it's like I didn't sleep. It's like living two lives. Except one's a little bit cooler because like sometimes you're flying around and stuff. They're not like all bad dreams. It's just so real that it's like no sleep. And that's when the alcohol comes into play because I was like, fuck this. I'm going to drink to the point where I'm going to pass the fuck out and black out. And I'm out. And I did. You know? <laughs> and that's kind of where I became the alcoholic. You know? Blacking out. is a horrible thing. Because, you know, one minute you're hanging out, talking to your friends. Next minute, you wake up in your bed, wondering what the fuck happened. So you call your friend, and guess what? They're not your friend anymore. Because you tried to fight them or you said some sh like I wasn't really much of a like trying to fist fight someone black though I was more of a verbal abuse person so I would say some fucked up shit to people things that I'm like dude no fucking way did I say that because it's normally they say oh when you're black though that's how you really feel no Trust me, it ain't. Okay, let me give you an example. One night I was blacked out. Somebody told me. I was asking where I was. So everyone knows Trevoris is not my name on here. Well, what does Trevoris spell? Take one E out. Oh, it's Trevor. Ooh, big mystery. Holy shit. That's my name. Trevor. So I was blacked out. And... I was saying, where's Trevor? Think how fucking creepy that would be. Imagine being in front of somebody that's blacked out. Let's say their name is Steven or Jonathan or Jacob. And they're asking where they are. That has to be fucking creepy. That's, that's got to be weird. And it's like, dude, you're you you're right there, man. What are you, what are you talking about, dude? You're creeping me out, bro. Yeah. So saying that when people are blacked out, that's what they really mean? No. No, it's just they're they're hurting. So they want someone else to hurt with them. Misery loves company, I guess, I'm assuming. They don't know. No. Because I know what I feel. I know, you know. No. Not at all. No way. I mean, the shit that I've been told that I've said. There's no fucking way that I feel that way in, like, actual life. Because I'm an honest fucking person, man. I'd, I'd just tell them how I feel. I mean, if I got a problem with you, I'll let you fucking know. Trust me. So yeah, that whole theory of uh, when you're blacked out, that's who you are and that's what... You, no. No. I mean, I, I, maybe with some people, but with me, fuck no. Like, no. No. Don't really wish ill upon anybody. 
If anything, I wish ill upon myself because I hated myself. <laughs> God, this fucking nasal shit sucks. During and before this video, that, that's another thing about drugs. You can fuck up, if you're sniffing it, you can fuck up your nasal cavity. Cavity. So, once that happens, you kind of, like, go to sniff something and your nose will just close up. So, I have to hold my head up so, like, the and my headphones are about to fall off. So I found a way to clear up the blockage or let it open up so I can abuse it more. Smart, right? Yeah. The thing is, they don't tell you. Well, they actually do. It does say on the box, don't use longer than three days. There's a reason why. Your nose gets addicted to whatever that chemical is that opens it up. So when you do that, the uh, your nose will close up on its own. Like it just closes until you use uh, the nasal spray. And I've been like this now for a very long time. Stop sniffing drugs, but I sound like I'm a fucking cokehead. You like people probably wonder why is he always sniffling? And then that's why. Afrin. There's a there's a chemical oxy oxy something. It just I just remember oxy because oxy calling oxy oxy metaboline or metabolism something like that. I would blow my nose, but that makes it worse. It's like it irritates it and it makes it just swell up more. So I gotta wait till it works, and then eventually it calms down, and I'm still going. <laughs> and it just sucks. I didn't get anything from that, right? So I haven't got any special things. I beat everything, right? Okay, now it's time to fucking open up everything. So the fight before this, when I used the same noob team... And uh, I used Scorpion. I got way less hearts that time than I did this time. I got way more this time than I did, yeah, that time. I think I might get an Epic. Like, how sure am I? 60%, which is pretty fucking high. Because I didn't get anything unless I skipped through it and I wasn't paying attention. Shitty thing is, usually I use uh, five, uh, five strengths and five hearts, or at least five strengths, so maybe I won't. Should get something, though, because I opened up all the tombstones, I did all the fights, I left, wait, no, wasn't there one fight I didn't do? Mm, I don't know. We'll see. Let's hope. Let's hope. I, I'm, I'm fucking hoping. I want Shang Tsung's friendship. That's what I. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. I want Shang Tsung's friendship. You blocked it. Whatever. Whatever. That's good that you tagged in because this spell.
Shabam. Shabam, and you are dizzed. I wonder if I take longer, is it better? Or if I beat it quicker, is it better? I, I Again, I wonder if all of this shit combined, getting all the graves, fighting all the fights in a certain way, and then having time left on bosses, I wonder if all of this combined will help you get something or not. Fuck, I got nothing. So me, I wasted everything. Sucks to be me. Not really, but... Let's see, what do we got? Classic Liu Kang. That sucks. Cold War, classic. Raid... Oh, no. I hope it's not Mournful that is getting the upgrade. This is bullshit. Like, what, wait, what does this go to? Fine, you ain't gonna show... Me. Okay. You pricks. That's bullshit. This right here, if you want to do this, cool. Have another fucking card right here and another card right here. It fucking fits. Don't be douchebags. Keep giving us our fucking crypt uh, equipment. Always give us... It can fit two more in here. They could fit more than that. But move these three over and keep giving us our crypt event stuff otherwise what's the point of me doing this this crypt like fuck this game then oh but oh that's why because they'll sell they'll sell this you know what why don't they just sell me a 999 friendship epic i don't want to spend 1999 on a chance of an epic that's bullshit dude it is. It, it, come on, tell me that's not fucking bullshit. Stop being scumbags. You guys are so close on being not scumbags. Why is there five things on currency? Oh my god, they put this under currency. But it's a... Mm, my god. <sighs> That's why they didn't put the friendship in. They're going to sell Quan Chi's Brutality next. Watch. And of course, you know me. I want to X that out. I have it Fusion 4. The thing is, it should be 100% guaranteed. Fifty-fifty. 50 Better than 20. Yeah, what I mean is 20%. Well, that's right, I also got T-Mobile money. Nice. Thank you. I put a hundred in that. Mmm. 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 I don't know about that. Hmm. Anyways, that's this video. Maybe the next one will be a pack opening. Small pack opening video. So, uh, yeah. Stay safe. Be yourself. Ay, fuck. Wasn't supposed to say stay safe. Well, actually, at the moment now, I feel like it's, uh, it's important. And if you are on opiates, man, do the best you can. Try to seek help. That's the best thing I can say. And if you are booting, you know, try to step down. You know, 
if you know if, if you're sniffing if you're sniffing it try to get off if you're booting try to start sniffing and then get off the main goal is to get clean and if you can do that then fucking right because you are the 20% that actually ever gets clean so beat the fucking beat beat the statistics and let's raise that. Should be more than 20%. You can do it. Remember, you can. On that note, again, stay safe, be yourself.